between the lines. Three, two, one, go! Here's the last sandstorm here. Red Alliance trying to stay in it. We have a hatch panel moving on from Team Taters. They're placing that hatch panel already on level one of the Red Alliance rocket. Nerd Herd in blue. They place a hatch panel on the side of the Blue Alliance cargo ship and their alliance partners as well. Spartabots placing another hatch panel and retaining that cargo in the nose cone of that Blue Alliance cargo ship. It's tied up even at 27 points. Red Alliance with three more from some cargo scarred. On the Red Alliance side, they pull into the lead just after the match, but they're tied up now. It's neck and neck with only one piece of cargo making the difference so far. Already three pieces of hatch panels on that Red Alliance rocket from Team Taters. Looks like Bear Metal's encountering all the defense right now from the Blue Alliance defense of Prometheus blocking out Bear Metal from Red, but they're gonna swing past and score in that Red Alliance cargo ship. Meanwhile, Team Taters and Red continuing to score, placing two pieces of cargo in level one of that Red Alliance rocket. We have defense still coming in from Jaguar Robotics. Jaguar Robotics trying to block out these Blue Alliance robots. We have Spartabots going back to their depot, grabbing some cargo and making their way to the rocket for the Blue Alliance. They're gonna swing past the defense, trying to make this path through that Jaguar Robotics defense. Meanwhile, Nerd Herd continuing to score cargo. That's piece number two of cargo being placed in the Blue Alliance rocket by Nerd Herd bouncing up. They're gonna score that right now from the Nerd Herd on the Blue Alliance side. Red Alliance in the lead. They're looking to take it to three. They're about 10 points up right now, but it could change at any moment as we enter the final minute of the match. Here comes Nerd Herd. Three more points from them in the cargo ship. Over on Red Alliance, Team Tater also three more points scoring in the cargo ship and they're hit by Prometheus playing defense. Here comes T Tater, three more points on that cargo ship for Red Alliance, bringing them up with 62 points, maintaining that small lead as Bear Metal trying to get some more cargo with that cargo's patched up. They're trying to get past some of those stuck hatch panels on that loading zone. They clear it out with 40 seconds remaining. Red Alliance still keeping that victory. 41, 92 on the Red Alliance. It's Jaguar Robotics pushing around the Nerd Herd. Nerd Herd still trying to get past and score. Looks like 29, 76, trying to get that piece of cargo. Well, they're not able to grab it. They're grabbing it right now with T minus 17 seconds remaining. There comes Team Taters placing one more hatch panel on that Red Alliance rocket, maintaining that lead of 10 points. We're gonna see who can climb now in the last 10 seconds. Team Taters going up to level two for six points on the Blue Alliance side. We have Prometheus up on level three for 12. We have Nerd Herd for three points and their Alliance partners for three and blue as well with one second remaining. 20, 46, trying to get up there. Bare Metal stayed on level one. They didn't get up to level three. It's gonna be a close one here. We're gonna have our Red Alliance by one point with a score of 86. Blue Alliance a score of 85. Have climbing points can make the difference here. It's a very close match. We got one match won by each.